Yo, what is up guys? What's up? It's your boy, Mr. Ambitious. If you're new, welcome. And if you're ready, subscribe. What's up, bro? Now, if everybody could do me a uh, big favor. Um, excuse me. Um, drop off, subscribe, and turn on post notifications, and like a couple of my videos, and share my channel to your friends. And it costs nobody. It's hella free. I mean, it just takes like, not even two or three seconds to hit that bell and subscribe. It will help my channel a lot, and I'm just trying to build my channel a little bit bigger. And, yeah, it will help my channel a lot. Now, again, these videos are for educational purposes only. I do not condone any illegal activity or anything. Everything I do in this video is for personal uses only. I do not participate in any illegal, like, activities or shit like that. It's just for personal use, again, how I said. So, with that, in today's video, I'll be showing you the hotspot method. Now, this is highly recommended because a lot of people have issues with the, what you would call it, with the wireless method. Now, this is going to be the hotspot slash VPN method. So, it works the same. The only thing that's going to be different is that I'll, what, I'll, I'll show you what's, what's different between the hotspot method and the VPN method. So, first off, you're going to want to make sure you have your, um, what you would call it. Um, your Octo Sniff open. So once you have that open, let me go back to my other screen. Now once you have that open, you're gonna want to go to your settings. Then you're gonna want to go. Make sure you turn on your wireless thing if you're not connected to Ethernet. So I'm connected to Ethernet. So what you do that is gonna automatically turn on your your Wi-Fi, your wireless Wi-Fi uh, setting. So if you're on the laptop, what you want to do is go to edit and then go to network bandwidth or network band and change it to five gigahertz. So once you do that, you have better connections. And if your laptop cannot handle it, then that's just going to be on probably like, like the computer's problem. That's going to be on you. It just depends what kind of computer you have. I'm on a desktop. So once you change it to five gigahertz, you get better connections. You change the name, put the password, click save. Then you click turn on. Now once you turn that on, you're gonna go back to your Xbox. So mine's right here, so let me full screen this. Now once you like go back to your Xbox, you're gonna go to your Wi-Fi settings, network settings, manage setup. Go to the find whatever you named it. So my password is gonna be fuck you. I don't know what the fuck was the password. I oh, fuck you six six six. Okay, so fuck you. Six six six. Oh man, my throat is sore. I've been talking a lot, like pretty much all day. When I talk a lot, my voice gets like, it kind of hurt, like hurts my vocal cord and it kind of hurts to talk. Now, once you connect to your hotspot, normally, you're gonna go back to Octo, but since I'm gonna use the hotspot method, I mean the VPN method, I'm gonna open Octo VPN. Wait for this to load up. Go to my VPN server, then turn it on. Now, if you're doing the VPN method, I'm gonna show you what to do. So once you're on your, you turn on your VPN. Now, hold on, did, I, did it connect? Uh, let's see, yeah, okay, it connected. So as you can see, I am now on the hotspot. Uh, on hotspot, but I'm gonna do the VPN method. So, as you can see, it's right here. Now you're gonna go to change adapter settings, and then you're gonna wanna go to your tap Windows adapter V9, go to properties, go to this, go to sharing, click allow, then click your the local connection, then you click okay. Then you close all this, 
then you go back to your game now before I show this I'm gonna make sure my VPN is connected Now we go to my IP. What's my IP? And, and yes, we are connected. So we're gonna go to Google. And as you can see, I am connected to my VPN. So once you check that, you're gonna close this, go back to home. So then minimize my screen. Then we're gonna go ahead and pull Octo Sniff right here. And then you're gonna go to where it says your local connection. So it's gonna be this one right here, the local connection. Then after that, you're gonna like load up a game or something. So let me minimize this. Oh, trying to minimize it. So let's see, let me shorten this. Make sure Octo Sniff is right here. Now, depending on what filter you're using, now this is the hotspot method slash VPN method. So it's it's the same. The only thing just for the normal hotspot method is that you don't gotta that you don't gotta connect to the your VPN. So as long as you go, as long as you have your tap windows adapter shared and everything, you're good. So now we're gonna go to uh, my games. Now we're gonna test this on Fortnite. We're gonna yeah, we're gonna test this on Fortnite just for the server. Now, for, in order to get the server IP for Fortnite, you're gonna wanna go to your settings, go to game filters, and you're gonna wanna enable the Fortnite one. So let's see, uh, Fortnite, yep, we click that. Make sure nothing else is enabled. Make sure the filter tabs is enabled. Then we're gonna be in filtered. Now that we click OK, click my account. Now, sorry for the loading screen time. Yeah, we're going to skip that. Now. Again, if you guys click the fucking ARP and you lag out, it is the ARP. It is sending an ARP attack to your router, making it send more packets to OctoSniff. Now, if you lag out, it's because your router is blocking it. The fire, Your router's firewall is blocking it. So that's why I recommend the hotspot method. So once you do that and you're about to join the game, you're going to want to click Start Sniffing. Make sure you have this turned on before you join the game. You just want to leave sniffing on and be on the filter tab. This works the same way with R6 and everything else. Now, if it doesn't pop up right away, just click stop and then it will pop up. So as you can see, the server IP is right here. Someone blurred out, but it's going to be Fortnite. So as you can see, the hotspot method is recommended. So yeah, as you can see, it does work and everything. I showed you everything, how it's set up and everything for the hotspot and the VPN method. But if you can't configure your VPN through your router, use the hotspot VPN method. So, you know, nobody could fuck with you. But anyways, that's how you set it up. And with that, guys, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, bro. And take it easy, man.